got an early first round encounter between Nicholas Muller of Switzerland and Faraz Khan of the United States. Nicky Muller. That's a great oh. shot. That's an example of the talent of Nicky Muller. Ball slightly wide on the cross court, Five, comes six. off the back wall and then waits for it to drop in. Oh, that's nice. Stepping up now, PJ, isn't he? Nicholas Muller. He has. Yeah. It's, it's been Just a game a of two halves, edge. really, for yeah. Muller. And out. 8-9. Completely flat-footed here. Taxi for Muller. Right. Yeah, it's good pressure. 11-8, game to Muller. Muller leads one game to love. Great tennis player, but... Wonderful, yeah. Time. Oh, oh, he's done him again. Oh, I mean, that will really, really annoy Nicky well, Miller. Yeah. And Leisure Centre boast for the winner. Look. Look. That game went away from uh, Muller very... Or this game is going away from Muller very quickly. Faraz Khan not giving up the ghost on any of these balls, these attacking balls, and I think that is troubling Nicholas Muller, that that ball keeps coming back. Yeah, it's quality. It's well straightened from the front there from Muller. Left side, 4-8. Oh, Six game balls for Khan to level this first round of the US Open and up and he's four. done it. Game to Khan. Little effort One game from Nicky Muller, giving place. up the ghost. He's now got 90 seconds to get himself. And out, 1-5. Tidy work. The damage was done with the length, really. We always see the finished product going into the front of the court. Three. But there you can see how far into the back mm. of the court Faraz Khan has had to try. Down. 11-4, game to Muller. Well, you heard the cry of so bad there by Khan, one. but that's a lot of credit has to go to Nicky Muller for the, the change in attitude in that third. But but a bit, yeah, a bit of work into the legs and... You know that Muller is comfortable when this shot's being played. That top spin. Uh, ball was good. Pick up was good yeah. from Khan. And he, Khan's gone back to this, like the hustle. Oh! oh! And yes, please. Left side, nice, nice little. Well played trickle boast at the front. It was looking one. a bit shaky 11, in the third, in the 11, second game, but 11, he four, pulls it 11, out of the bag. Nine.
that yet again moves Faraz Khan on that diagonal. And this time a stretch too far. 51 minute game, absolutely fantastic display of tenacity and hustle. Uh, well, welcome back to the uh, magnificent home of US squash here in Philadelphia. Um, center. So he's, so he's getting a lot of work done. Well, I saw his new head coach um, here in the premises, Ong Beng Hee, recently announced as the national coach. Five. Well, it's just two points adrift now, Brownell. Brownell, the Brownell name is synonymous with U.S. squash. His mom is one of the coaches of um, under. Well, she she was coaching an under 17 girls team when I was on the same Hand team as her, a coaching four. team. Um, Yeah, that's a wicked cross-court winner Truman. from Cruan. Cruan leads one game to love. Watch this for a finish. Whips the racket head through. Yes, uh, Four, three. good shot into the back corner. Outright winner at the back. So strong off that back leg. Good squeeze and well played by Brunel. He's taking this game very much to the Frenchman. Still six game balls for Cruan, uh, for Brunel. Down. There you go, another error. He went walkabouts a bit there, the Frenchman. Brunel taking full advantage of that lapse. Really. How good are those hands there? Hand out, yeah, beautiful five. technique. Softening up that drop on the racket. It's a good lift. Oh, that's clever. <laughs> the fanned backhand volley Nine there. Five. Such a hard shot to play, even harder to see. Lovely shot from Karan. Yeah, it's a great finish. He finished the first 11, game five, on the forehand with a cross-court kill. Leads, this time, he's shown his skill on the backhand. So sparring up and down this left-hand side again. Both players very comfortable down the left-hand wall. The crew and backhand and the, the forehand for Brunel. Two love. He's got a very natural hold. He snaps his racket up very early. Down. Oh. One other error two. from Brunel. Just being made to hit an extra... Well, there's the error from Brownell. A few too many to errors in that game from the American, but a really good battle between these two. Brown certainly five, didn't have it all 11, his own four. way. Nicely contested match. But it's Cruan who's safely through into the next round. 
So 43 minutes that match between Victor Cruen and Timothy Brownell. It's Greg Lobben, the Scot, up against Switzerland's Dimitri Steinman. It's a very impressive boast on the volley. Difficult shot. It's nice play here from Steinman. Very good play. Simple yeah. and effective. Patience here from Lobben. Really Down. good patience. He's hitting very good straight lines. 9 6. Yeah, superb finish from Lobben. With three game balls. Out. Again, good squeeze, good work at the back of the court. You can see the frustration there Lobin. from Lobin Dimitri. Leads. Off we go. And out for one. Oh, he's absolutely nailed that one. Yeah, well, he had to, didn't he? Because <laughs> otherwise, he was going to leave himself massively exposed. Nine, six. Yeah. He's taking this into the back of the court. Him. Three game balls. Turn this into a one-all battle. Yeah, nicely done. 11-7. Game on. Game to Steinman. One game all. Between these two, no surprise. The first meeting on the PSA World Tour. Very tidy play here from Lobin. Oh, wow. It's impressive movement from Steinman. He's doing some work, though. Yeah, I mean, Lobin's dictating play here. Even if Steinman wins this, he's had to work so hard. And again, he's having to play shots with, right with a really high degree of difficulty. Yeah, it's a great rally. Steinman happy to go for the towel, which you'd expect after doing all this work. From Steinman. Down. There you go. 11-3, game to Lobin. Lobin leads. Two games it's to an one. impressive game from Greg Lobben. It takes its toll massively. Down. Well, it's another er error from right Steinman. 7-1. That's five of the seven points. Yeah, and the shoulders are down, they're slumped, and Greg Lobben's just got to crack on here. side 10-2 match ball well the yes, error sir. from right. Steinman the wheels have come off eight game match balls for Greg Lobben stroke to Lobben well there you go that's 11, the end of that two. game and match to Lobben or Three capitulated games to slightly one. for Dimitri Steinman at the back end of that match 11-2 57 minutes, 3-1 for the Scott. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's good athleticism from Kendra. So Three strong on that left leg. He's in his hometown here, Todd Harity. He's playing at the US Center. He's got all the cards. He's got a lot of experience under his belt. Has now, yeah, it's good length, immaculate hitting. He's had five four, strokes. Four or five strokes, five in, strokes there, yeah. in this and first game. Now got six game balls. Amazing. Dream start for the American. Yeah, that's tidy. Just four, stops the movement of Kendra there. Lovely, leads, lovely, lovely soft hands from Harity. Get some energy into his system. Interesting service technique here from Kendra. Likes to create a slightly different angle by serving backhand, taking his eye off the opponent. Not recommended for the faint-hearted. Well, that's aggressive. 6-3. Three game to Kandra. It's good response from Kandra. Much more business-like from the German. Clinical. Yeah, he's going to ask a few questions now. Of just snatching slightly. It's a healthy lead in this third game. Seven-three. Better though, tidy finish. Hand out, 5 10, game ball. Down. Slam himself Eleven down there. Five, game to Condra. Condra leads two games to one. So, fortunately, the errors are the crucial times for Harity. Did you struggle on the backhand? And the forehand. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't really struggle that much. Both sides. Down. It's another gift. It's a good touch oh, again. That's an unbelievable. It's good retrieving. Yeah, very athletic. Oh, there's the leisure. Didn't fall him at all. Oh, that is magnificent and finish. From opening the court with a leisure centre boast, Kandra got court punished. Service, please. All stem from court that. Service, please. Slightly wonky shot selection. That's a lovely finish there. From Harrity. Three game balls for Harrity. To push on further. He's going to do it. Down. He's done it. There's a response. You can hear the crowd behind him. 11 7, game to Harrity. Two games off. Well, when we look at the duration. Hand out, 5-1. He seems to be running away with this now, the lefty. Hand out, 3-8. Rafi Kandra now with six match balls to book his place in round two tomorrow. And he's going to get it straight off. 11-4, match to Kandra, three games to two. Four, 11, 11, three, 11, five, Some really encouraging seven, 11, stuff there. 11, four. From Todd Harity, unfortunately couldn't capitalize on the 2-1 lead. Just shy of the hour, so light on the ground really for five games.